Hi guys, welcome back to This is a Sign. In this video, I'll be using Rodin, which is a image or text to 3D model AI software um, that I used to create these Adida gazelles and I incorporated it in my workflow to just create these 3D chrome molten sneakers, if you will. So if you want to learn how to make this and how to use Rodin in your everyday workflow, stick by. First thing I did was figure out what sneakers I wanted. For this uh, tutorial, I'll be using their text uh, to 3D asset feature. You can also use the image 3D asset. So I typed in Adidas, Gazelle, sneakers, um, and then I pressed the, the generate button and, and then it'll pop up with another window where you can adjust the mesh and various settings and as you can see it gave me a uni sneaker like it, it looked like two sneakers but it really was just one so with ai nothing's perfect and this is a beta model so i went back and i adjusted my text to make sure to tell the ai that i just wanted one singular sneaker because that was my original idea so once it generates your base model you'll essentially need to verify two different steps. So first is the base model where you can adjust the geometry under the geometry generation tab. You can adjust it to have symmetry, um, to have sharp or smooth edges, etc. One of the key features in Rodin is the redo button and they give you up to 10 redos, I believe. So this really helps the AI further adjust your model to make it even better so i would really suggest to utilize the redo button because that's what made my sneakers better than the first original um, ai render once you're happy with the 3d base model you can go ahead and press confirm and it'll generate the base model and that we can move on to the material generation in the material generation section you'll be able to adjust the pbr temperature which basically just means how complex or detailed your PBR is and also adjust uh, the reference strength. So how close it is to the reference image if you use an image. Lastly, I confirmed my material and I chose the file type that I wanted and I went ahead and generated my 3D model and it automatically downloaded to my computer. Now back on Blender, I went to file imports and I imported my file. And I'm pretty much ready to start my molten chrome on the sneakers. I essentially just use metaballs. So I went to add metaball and I lined them in the order and shape that I wanted. I just added one metaball and I went ahead and copy and pasted as many as I needed. I then converted it to a mesh so it can become one single object. And I added a metallic material in my shade editor tab by adding a simple principle bdsf and i put the metallic to one one and the roughness to close to zero that pretty much concludes the tutorial i hope you guys have fun with the rod and ai text to 3d unreal engine and also making your molten chrome sneakers if you have any questions feel free to leave them down in the comments Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one.